already make sure you are subscribed and click the post notification bell and turn on so that way you get notified every time i post a new video period but we just got to the room it's been a really long day i really haven't did much talking on the vlog at all whatsoever i pretty much just been out and about ever since we got from our flight we literally hit straight to the malls and we literally went to like three four five different malls outlet malls regular malls and we pretty much been busy but i haven't been talking to y'all literally none of this whole video so i don't really know how i'm gonna match this up and how i'm gonna vibe everything out together but i'm pretty sure it's probably gonna be a little montage for y'all so that's what y'all gonna get because it's been a little busy day and i didn't even expect it to be that busy honestly yes. when we first walk in this is the front door then as soon as you also walk in you got the bathroom pretty nice wood Got the nice whatever countertop. And you also got, let's see. They got, what is this? Okay, so whatever this is, I don't know what that is. And then boom, we got the big tall mirror. Super cute, nice little counter. They got good hair day. Stacked up on the toilet paper, just how we like it. Then we got the push. Ah, period. They got the backsplash on the wall. They got some super good lighting, y'all. And then this is the shower, nice clear doors. And then you also got, let me make sure I can zoom in for y'all. You also got this soap dispenser. It's up against the wall. Super creative, nice light and shine down on the shower. So that's as normal. And then behind the door is literally nothing. And then when you first walk out the bathroom by the front door, you got the big tall mirror that is like literally nice and tall. And I look extra crusty because I've been on a flight and at the malls all day. Then you got whatever this is. It's pretty much like a coat where you can put your jackets and everything. But this is really cute and creative, different colors. Then you also have this little area that I pretty much already jumped up. But it's like a little table right here. And then you can also store, I guess, your stuff in the freezer. So it's like a mini freezer or whatever. And then you got the ironing board, iron, little hanger spot. So that's nice, cute, creative. And then the light right above us. So pretty much over here, we got the king size area where our bed is at. So we have a king size bed. The covers look like they could be a little bit more thicker because you know how the traditional hotels be. You know what I'm saying? If you know, you know. But pretty much you got a nice stand over here. Got the little light. It's really cute. I think you can kind of flip. Yep, you can turn this any direction that you want to go. And then you just got a little space down there. And then over here, you just got our suitcases. And then you actually have like a little table where you can lay your suitcases, I guess. And then... And then you also have this space underneath this. So I guess you can pretty much store your suitcases. And then boom. Period. Welcome, Samaria. Period. So this is pretty much our TV. You also have like a little USB port right there on the side. Then you got the remote. Over here you have like a little study area. So you pretty much just got your little desk. This is probably where I'll be doing my makeup and pretty much getting ready. And then leading up to that, up against this wall, you also have this little decorative nightstand over here, which I don't know why my side is so bland, but that's okay. And then you also got a little switch, which leads to the lights over there. So if you press it on and off, that controls that light over here right next to my bed. And then you also have this little light right here. 
this little light in my Hey, I'm gonna let it shine. Let me stop playing. But you also can move this around. So that's gonna be really good at nighttime. So this is pretty much like the whole nighttime vibe because we came at seven o'clock, so it's kind of dark. So it's not like giving extra sunlight. But then this is pretty much like the parking lot, the pool that's down there, which I don't even know was open. I might go down there sooner or later. But anyways, y'all, this is pretty much the whole view. So I'm gonna show y'all this in the morning, and it's probably gonna look super bright, super pretty. But but other than that, y'all, I'm just not getting to the hotel. Oh, I look crusty. So anyways, y'all, I'm looking extra, extra, extra cursed, crusty. So let me get y'all back up. It's been a really long day, a really eventful day. I've been at the mall literally all freaking day. So yeah. Good morning, guys. What's up, my babies? It's your good baby Sam back on a mother film, period. So, good morning, guys. It is the next day. It is 9.23 in the morning on a Saturday. Per I'm, like, tired, y'all. I actually got up at 7.30 on a random, and I don't even get up that early. When I go out of town, I'm not get up that early. But today, we up that early. I'm about to just go ahead and start getting ready. My plans for this morning is to go to the nail shop because yeah, my toes look a hot mess. And when I was at home, I didn't really get to get nothing done. As y'all can see, I don't have my lashes done. Maybe my feet is not done. Nothing. Because it was just a whole bunch of inconvenient things that was just going on to the point I couldn't get nothing done at home. Now, today, I forgot to tell y'all, today's agenda is the nail shop and some breakfast. And then we're going to this boxing fight, this Earl Spence junior versus some other boxer i don't know see. that's not really my cup of tea but i'm going with my boyfriend and some other people so there's kind of like they think that, that, that they got going on so i'm just going so we're going to this boxing event later on tonight or this evening and then your girl got a cute little outfit yesterday at the mall from fashion over that i did not vlog so i'm gonna show you how to fit when we get ready because we're gonna do a whole look get ready with me i wish i could do like a separate talking video because this aesthetic in the background is very pleasing but i don't really have nothing to make a separate video about so if i come up with some ideas then yeah i'm gonna see to get ready with me in the bathroom as i have another video we're just gonna speed up this little process and yeah i just gonna be rolling with your girl for the day <laughs> just pretty much going to i went to the nail shop i went to bellagio nail bar and super bougie pretty much more little story y'all but a little ashy but i mean he did okay or whatever besides my feet being ashy because i literally just got out the shower and as soon as i got the shower I went straight to the nail shop so never been to the nail shop and the lady like just where she knew me but i'm like sweetheart so you don't know me never seen you before what are you talking about but it was a pretty good experience. I mean, it's like super bougie. So, yeah, if you know, you know. But after that, we pretty much went to Walmart. I'm going to show y'all my little fit for today. It's a little cute, little high tech, giving very much soccer mom. Very much soccer mom. I look like I got a kid that I'm about to take the soccer practice, period. But pretty much just Nike tech, little biker shorts, Gucci slides, period, as you can already see. Got the shades on top of the head. My wig is kind of cutting up a little bit. It's kind of cutting up in the front. I don't really like that, but it's cool. It's cool. So, yeah. And then we went to Walmart after we left the nail shop and got something to eat. And then I'm going to show you my little mini Walmart haul. I'm so surprised I haven't went to Ulta yet, but I don't think I'm going to make it to Ulta. Not this trip. But when I got from Walmart... I pretty much just got me some salon hair clips because I don't know if 
my Walmart have this where I live at, but I don't think they normally have these salon clips. And for me, I never seen anything like this. Yeah, I got me some press ons. I haven't bought press ons since I was like maybe in probably late elementary, early middle school. And I got like some French tip press ons. Then I also got me some lashes because I don't have my lashes done. Of course, I have the regular strips, which I don't normally wear. So this is just good when I'm doing my makeup and stuff like that. And I actually might put these on tonight for the boxing event. So your girl might slap these on and take these off because I like the lashes I have on now. It's just, I don't really know. Like when I do my makeup, I don't like big and bulky. So I don't know. We're going to see if I keep these on or change them out to these. And then, of course, I got me some sugar scrub. If you know, you know, this is like literally the bomb diggity. This smells really good. I'm going to actually put this in my check bag because I know airports be on VS when it comes to taking big bulky things like this. But we actually traveled with Noxzema, so and we got through with it. So I'm going to actually try to bring this and then I'm putting it in my check bag so that way they don't, you know what I'm saying, try to get your girl. Yeah. Finesse. Then I just got me a little shower cap because, of course, with the shower cap, I normally begin my body wet a little bit when I be washing like the back of my neck and stuff like that up close to like my hairline in the back. I begin my body wet and I don't like this. I have to actually had to get me a shower cap because I don't think we got these at home too. And then of course I got me a wide comb because I gotta comb out my curls later on tonight. I'm actually recurly just a little bit to put like a little bit more off in this um hair set that I got. But after today, once I put a little umph in, I'm not gonna really recurl it no more. So I got me a wide comb. So and then, of course, I got me some little secret. I normally don't use the secret deodorant, but we're going to see what it's talking about. And then I got my bestie, my makeup wipes, because, of course, you need the makeup wipes when you do your makeup. That's pretty much it. I'm not about to do nothing else. I think it's almost 1 o'clock. It's 12.47 now in the afternoon, so I'm probably just going to chill until, like, 2, and then I'm going to start getting ready. The event is at 5 o'clock this after well this evening the event is at five o'clock so i might get ready starting at two because i still want to do my hair get cute i'm gonna take my pictures and do what it do oh yeah also i gotta show you my favorite twin outfit i got me an outfit to wear tonight cute per i went to zara the girls who get to get it if you went to zara before sunny honey shout out to you because Zara got some cute stuff, but I'll be thinking they be having like normal price, average chick type of prices on their clothes. But sweetie, no, everything look like a grandma in there. Everything is overpriced. I was not about to pay, I was not about to pay sixty dollars for a little crop top that looked like somebody little sister could wear. No, no man. So the mall yesterday, I went to Sephora. I pretty much just got my milk hydro primer. I came down here with just some black shorts, some black leather shorts. So I'm gonna show y'all that once I get dressed. But the black shorts, it's a vibe, sweetie. And then, of course, I had to come down here and find me a shirt, which none of the malls are selling nothing that's cute that I actually like. So, I was kind of disappointed by that. But then, when we had went to the last mall, I was like, and I, oop, because baby, they had a favorite between one, and I already knew I was going to be able to find me something up in there. Well, their clothing sizes in the malls are like people that damn near eat on diets every single day, all year round, 365. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm a thick girl, so I got a little weight on so. We ain't got time to be shopping at extra smalls and small. So I really didn't find nothing down her that I like in their malls except like the area that we in. I got this cute little jean jacket. It's not a jean, but it's like a it's like a soft material type of jean jacket. So it's like a little crop top jacket. And then it's like the details on it or whatever. Of course, I got the white flats. Period. Toes white. So it only makes sense to get those. And then I got like a little white crop top shirt. This is like really good quality. So February 20, I'm gonna be having that ish, but a little white crop top that I'm gonna actually put in my black shorts. I actually high waisted. So the white crop top, it should look pretty good with the black shorts because the black shorts kind of come up to like mid stomach area. I got the shades, of course. And then I got like a little silver necklace. So that wasn't bad. All of that stuff that I got was for the same price as Zara was charging for just a shirt and some pants. So what was gonna be the point? You know what I'm saying? So at least this stuff can be repeatedly worn, but in its own style, in its own way. The shirt and the pants from Zara, you can only wear like one good time, take a picture in it, and you ain't got to wear it again. Like this is a waste of money, and baby, that was almost like a hundred some dollars. So these shades actually match the jacket. I thought it was kind of overdoing it, but I'm going to wear it like probably on top of my head and take pictures, or I'm going to kind of like wear glasses on the tip of my nose and take pictures with the jacket. So I don't really know how the picture's going to turn out, but by the time y'all see this, pictures are already going to be posted, and y'all already going to see how I'm going to style it up. So... We gonna see how I'm gonna actually put it together, but I'm gonna just sit, chill, watch TV, and then once I get ready for the fight, 
I'm gonna hit y'all back up and we're gonna go ahead and do our get ready with me. Let's do it. We are done getting ready and dressed. Yeah, like literally, I just put this shit on like zombie me, sweetie. Like, hi, my period. Um, I'm about to go ahead and take pictures. So, jacket is from Forever 21. If for anybody want to know, crop top is from Forever 21. Pants are from Chat on your member. Shoes is from Forever 21. And purse is from Forever 21. And glasses is also from Forever 21. Period. Let's give me the girls. Boss bitch. Period. Get into it. Period. Get into it. Be. Get into it. Be. Even if I take off the shades, this is how we looking. Still far, our makeup is on like a hundred right now. So yeah, we're about to go ahead and take these pictures, and then we're about to go ahead and roll. So I'll probably see y'all once I get there. So BRB. <laughs>
in our um that where we went today but we pretty much just went to some place called bombshell sweetie wasn't the best experience but whatever we back at the hotel we really didn't do much all day today but pretty much just went to my mom's house chill we didn't pull them in and had to see them so and then we pretty much just went to another family's house um some people that I'm with or whatever, we went to the side of family house and then we hung out with some more people. So like, we were just busy all together today. So I really didn't pick up the camera at all once again and I did not vlog and put nothing like on the screen for y'all to see. It's such a little montage that I'm going to include in there or whatever. I already knew like it wasn't going to be as adventurous this trip and plus I'm coming down here next month again in May for something. So it's like everything is kind of getting like not so much boring but like it's getting very much it's even very much casual after this i think i'm gonna be done pretty much recording going to dallas because i already did another travel vlog back in december and that was okay because we did some stuff but this vlog right here is mostly just about the whole earl spence fight or whatever which was crazy big fucking scene everybody was in our all the hoes was out, all the niggas was out, everybody was out, niggas with chains on, bitches with heels on, everybody was out. So, everybody was looking cute though. One thing I love about black people, but when we pop out, we pop out. And yeah, everybody we was sitting around was literally like droning and just having a whole good time. And we didn't even know none of these people. And nine times out of ten, they probably was from her. But we could never know because we don't even know the people in real life. So, it was cool yesterday, which was going to be more of the video. But other than that, today, y'all, we pretty much just chilled, did the normal, did nothing, hang out and see everybody and visit people. So that was just that today. But tomorrow is going to be Monday, and I'm probably going to go ahead and close the video out today because there's nothing else for y'all to see. Like, Monday is probably going to be the same thing as today, and there's no point in me keeping this vlog continuously going when I just go ahead and end it right now, which is what we're about to go ahead and do. So other than that whole trip was a vibe video hopefully was a vibe i'm gonna definitely sauce it up a little bit so it's very much interesting for y'all to watch but hopefully you enjoyed today's vlog so far you know what i'm saying i cannot wait to go on like more adventurous trips as far as like tropical vibes you know what i'm saying out of the country palm trees sun giving very much bathing suit you know what I'm saying? I can't wait to get those vibes for whatever trip that I go on pretty soon. But until then, y'all yeah, just gonna have to get these regular in-state vlogs. Okay, so I'm back. So without further ado, we're about to go ahead and close out today's video. If you enjoyed today's vlog, please make sure that you leave a big like on today's video. Make sure you comment down below and make sure you subscribe. And please do not forget to subscribe before you exit off my channel. Make sure you hit the post notification bell and turn it on so that way you are notified whenever I drop a new video. And without further ado, I will be back on the road to post videos for y'all, period. But I do gotta go ahead and give y'all some little life updates or whatever. So you are gonna be a little busy coming up next month. So on the road to bigger and better things. And I hope to see y'all in my next video and make sure you subscribe before you come back. Period. Thank you. Bye. All of my niggas stay hyping me up. Pretty but talk to them spicy as fuck. Niggas be asking me why am I single. Told them the money be tying me up.